Happy summer, everybody. We wait all year for the glorious days of summer. And sure, you may not have a fancy beach house down the shore, but there's plenty to do. Whether you are in the city, in the suburbs, or at the beach, I've got you covered for this amazing summer fun special. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started at one of my new favorite places in the city of Philadelphia called The Cauldron. <laughs> What is this place? What, what is this place? What is this place? This is amazing. Okay, this place is called The Cauldron and you don't have to go to Disney World. You don't have to be down the shore. This is a place that you're gonna wanna experience not just with your kids, but with your girlfriends, your guy friends, with everyone. So the Cauldron is an experiential restaurant. Yes. How are you? Um, you invented this. What's really cool is that you and your partner did this, but you're a local dude, right? Yeah, I'm from Arlton. That's really, really cool. Okay, so I said that you don't have to go to Disney World. Mm. We don't have to go to the shore. We can <laughs> still have a ton of summer fun in a here. Absolutely. And, and you'll forgive me, but I see a lot of stuff. I see fun for my girlfriends and I, because there's alcoholic drinks, and fun for my kids and I, because there's also mocktails, yes? That's it. Okay. Okay, so the signature experience is making a potion. That's it. Okay. Uh, so it's a one hour, 45 minute cocktail making experience. First things first, uh, we need to crush our ingredients. Okay. So if you could take your pestle and mortar. Crush so, them all? Crush them all. Okay. So inside of there we have cinnamon bark, thyme, cardamom, um, black tea, and fresh ginger. Now we need to get our, the rest of our ingredients. Take your magic wand. Okay. And you're going to tap our secret code. So start at the top. Yep. M. A. a G. Uh huh. I. C. Magic. Oh my goodness. Okay, so in here we this have. This is awesome. An adorable little owl jar. Yes, I All love right. an owl jar. Uh, one for me and one for you. So you make cocktails collaboratively with other people. Okay. Uh, so whoever you come with, you brew with. Okay, sounds good. Here we go. That's in there. All right. Had this guy. What is this? It's fairy dust. Fairy dust. Okay. Ooh. Mark. Ooh. Okay. Looks nice. Okay. <laughs> and you guys have one of the, two of these in London. That's right. One in Scotland and one in New York City. That's right. Okay. So this is our fifth location, uh, and it'll be the hub of our franchise operations in the U.S. Okay. So we want a little bit of the goodness in there. That's it. Okay. But your alcohol is in your jar, so don't worry. <laughs> this is the easiest cocktail I've ever made. Okay. And then I'm good. Yep. Hello. Oh, and a strainer. So we're going to strain that Thanks, in. Thanks, buddy. This is great. Cheers to you. This is the cauldron? This is the cauldron. This is called the lost time. Ooh, that's yummy. And it's not sweet. It tastes like chill. Yes. Like good, like yeah. yummy. Okay, so can we see some of the other stuff? Oh Absolutely. wait, what's going on here? Uh, so all of our decorations have been shipped over from London. Okay. Uh, so uh, we've got a, all different installations of, of magical props, uh, some magic wand interactive, um, some just magical. So these are some of the things that you might see if you're just coming in for a, a cocktail, That's right, right. Okay. yes. What do we have here? These are our bubbling shots of death. Okay. Uh, they're vodka, maduri, lemon, lime, and sugar. Okay. Really nice. It's a take on a melon ball. Right. They're safe to drink while they're bubbling. I'm not gonna do the whole thing, but I'm gonna take a sip. Shall we? Cheers. Cheers. This is awesome. Do I look weird drinking that? That's awesome. <laughs> okay, and that tastes really good. Yeah, it's good. Okay, what's All this All of thing? our drinks are good. <laughs> They're really good. So this is called The Blob. Okay. Uh, fashioned after the movie The Blob that right? keeps, has something that keeps growing and growing. Okay. So this is an agave and tequila based drink. It's a twist on a margarita. Okay. Uh, and the head has a flavor and it grows and grows and grows, so. Really? Yeah. Wait, that has a flavor or there's a head in there? No, no, this head of the, the, the cocktail. <laughs> okay. Should I try that? Try it. All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> this is like being at Willy Wonka. <laughs> okay, 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 I'm in, I'm in. What's this? This is called the Old Ode to Molica. Okay. It's a smoked old fashioned. So we smoke it with hickory. Um, it's an old fashioned cocktail. 
uh, that has a twist on it, and yeah, it, the infusion of it has to do with the smoke. Okay, I see her with fire in her hand. That's it. <laughs> okay, uh, what's gonna happen This is here? our Dragon's Breath cocktail. It's okay. one of our signature drinks. I love it. Uh, it is a strawberry daiquiri, because who doesn't love a strawberry daiquiri? I love uh, a strawberry daiquiri. Can so I do this? Yeah, you've got some Phoenix Ash, dash it on top. That is amazing. <laughs> so what's going on over here? This over here is our magical fish and chips because fish and chips are such a British thing. Yeah, you have to have that. Um, okay. So they're battered with Yard's beer, served um, on a bed of hot river rocks yep. with a sea salt water on top. Of course. That gives you the smell of the ocean as you're eating and enjoying your fish and chips. This is so crazy. it's a multi-sensory experience. I, I'm not worthy, but go ahead, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have our enchanted cauliflower cheese. Cauliflower cheese is like a British comfort food item. Yep. Um, and so we've deconstructed it, so it's flaming cauliflower that's then put out with ribbons of hot English cheddar. Okay, I can come in here with a reservation. Yes. I can come in here just to hang out. Mm -hmm. Thank you. This is a great thing. Congratulations. We're so excited to be in Philadelphia. It's such a great city full of great people, and great food and beverage, and we're just excited to enter the scene here. Okay, should I tap us out? Okay, How'd three, you do? two, one, goodbye. cool, right? And you don't even have to book an airplane ticket. Okay, that's a great thing to do, whether the weather is iffy or amazing. So if you have a day as glorious as this one, I recommend you head right down to Cape May, coming up some of my favorite places there. Okay, people, you might not have a shore house, but guess what? You have a great location right here in Cape May to visit. It's called the Beach Shack. So first of all, I wanna show you what their rooms look like. They have a cute little bunk bed for your buddies if you wanna bring the kids down. The other thing, you know how this is. You wanna be on the beach, you wanna be at the pool in the same kind of spot. You can do that here. Look at these cabanas. They set them up for you. You can be in the shade, you can see the water, you can have some fun. When you're done with the beach, by the way, it's right there. You walk over here, gorgeous new pool. How are you, buddy? I'm well, now, thank you. You'll forgive me. I know you're the boss around here. Yes. I want you to relax. Can we do this interview seated? Absolutely. Okay, so we're right here in front of your brand new reimagined pool, yes? Yes, that's correct. Um, and all of this, you know, is included when you do this for a night or two, correct? Absolutely. I think people forget that there are hotels, you know, down the shore, if you will. But I think these are so, look at this, perfect family location. Yes, absolutely. Um, that's what we try to cater to our families and, uh, you know, create lasting memories. I love it. Now, as a mom, like I do the work. Mm -hmm. I'm a real mom. Mm -hmm. I'm driving kids to school, lacrosse practice, ballet recitals. When I go on vacation, I want to be fully immersed. Um, you take care of that as well, yes? Yes, we do. <laughs> what is in this crazy drink? That is going to be a multiple of a mixes. Uh, rum is the, is the main part of that. Yeah. Uh, we got some strawberry, we got some grenadine, I'm working, some so I probably shouldn't touch that, but it's awesome. Um, I can order food right here? Absolutely. It's fun. Yes. When is the, I know that like obviously we're in the middle of the summer, so I'm sure you're crazy booked up. Is there any time between now and when school lets out where you think you it would be like a good window to try to get a room here? So we always have like some last minute availability. There's always the possibility of cancellation. Um, you know, when kids are out, like as January, or I'm yeah, sorry, June comes in, yeah. we're really picking up at the end of the month when school lets out yeah. through July and August. And then September's always a great time for, you know, a little getaway and uh, the weather is amazing. Okay. Thank you. And I just, I know that you do so much here. I wanted you to sit down. Thank Does you. it feel uncomfortable for you to be seated and partially resting? It is unusual. <laughs> Thank you so much. We love it here. My pleasure. The beach sack is awesome. Oh, by the way, the bar, amazing. They have beer, coldest beer in the entire world. Not really, but Cape May County as judged by an independent auditor. Well done. Thank you. Okay, what? A glorious way to spend a summer day. Hello. Hello. Okay, we're in Cape May County, and I want people to know it's not just about you know going to the shops, maybe having a drink at the places on the beach. You can actually do some stuff while you're here. Absolutely. Okay, this is Revolution Rail. What the heck am I on? You're on a rail bike. Okay. And 
basically, it feels like almost anyone could do this. Absolutely every, anyone could do this. This is fun for all ages. We have people from all ages here every single day riding the rails with us. Okay. Mm -hmm. You scooched up the seat a lot for me. Yes. Uh, what's the minimum size rider that you need to be? So we have one-year-olds that come out with us. We have really? a special um, kind of car seat. We strap them in real oh, tightly cool. and we allow their parents to, to pedal with them. Okay, and then older people, like clearly I'm not doing a lot of the pedaling. I'm doing a lot of this right here. Um, but here's the thing, I am a little bit mad at you. Yeah. You're mad at me. Because I didn't know that one seat was the regular seat and the other seat was the brake seat. The I want to be in control. Well, you could reach across to do that. Look at this. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> All right, so normally when you're giving people like the safety class, people are allowed to elect if they want to be the brake guy or the non-brake guy. Yes, we ask them to designate the most responsible person in their party to operate the brake seat. Well, no wonder I'm sitting here. <laughs> um, how long does this little uh, adventure last? This adventure is about 90 minutes. It's a four mile round trip that um, we take our um, guests all the way to the Cape May Canal. We flip the bikes around. We tell them a little bit about Cape May, Hi. the history of Cape May. We come about halfway back, get off the bikes again. We do a walk through um, the Garrett Family Preserve, which is a nature conservancy property right up here. Okay. Tell them about the ecology and the importance of the um, uh, the migration for birds and butterflies and bats and all sorts of stuff here in Cape May. We get back on the bikes. We take them back to the station so they can go get their mimosas. I was going to ask about a little snack or a little drink. I noticed there's a bucket in the back. Let's say I wanted to bring myself a snack or bring a drinky. Can I do that? We encourage um, guests to bring food and beverages on the trip, yes. Doesn't matter what it is? Just no smoking. I won't smoke. I don't smoke. And I won't vape either. No vaping either. <laughs> OK. Hey, thank you so much. Where do I figure out how to book this thing? Just visit www.revrail.com, R-E-V-R-A-I-L.com. Any chance the next time I do this, I can be designated the responsible person? We will give you the um, appropriate safety brief, yes, and you will be designated. Wow, I like to <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. Cape May is fun! Well, you're already down the shore. How about another spot? Atlantic City Fun is coming up. Welcome back. If you watch me during the week on Good Day, you know I love a great adventure. There are two new spots in Atlantic City that I say you just have to check out. All right, there's plenty to do down the shore, even when the weather is yucky. I like showing you guys some rainy day activities. This right here is a brand new racetrack. It's called Raceway. It's inside the showboat. And this is definitely something you could do when it's rainy, especially if you have a need for speed. What's really cool about this is it goes really, really fast. And I don't think that you have to be super tall to do it because they let me in. So that means if you have a 10 year old at home, they're probably the right size. And I have to say, it goes up to about 50 miles an hour. It's all Italian inspired. Yes, the turns are super fun. The whole thing is great. Again, it's one of the things that you're going to want to check out down the shore. Isn't this cool? It's just as special as the one in New York City. This is opening up soon, and of course, we had to give you your first look. It's gorgeous in here. Hi, guys. Hi, how are you? Okay, so first of all, the frozen hot chocolate's the most famous thing, right? Yes. Okay, so you get to hold the microphone, coach me through it. I hear from the chef, it's a W. So it's a spoon here, it's a this, and then a that. Yay, <laughs> chef says yes. Um, okay, you guys are inside the Ocean Resort. Obviously, the iconic location is in New York City where you have Kardashian super fans. Cher loves this place. So it, it's no surprise to me that you have some items that are inspired by your celebrity fans. Yes, yeah, so this is actually gonna be our Kendall creamsicle. Okay, what's in it? It's gonna be Kendall Jenner's 818, and then it has amaretto. 818 for those of you at home. Oh, it's tequila. tequila. Go ahead. And then we're gonna have amaretto, orange juice, and topped with club. But because it's Serendipity 3, it has to be a little bit extra. So pour it and let's see what it All looks right. like. Okay, because they can't, even though it's a giant, oh yes! 
It needs to be like a cauldron of magic. And I have to say, let's say you're down the shore with the kids and it's been raining. You bring a couple of mom friends over here, you're gonna need a drink like this. Absolutely. <laughs> it is pretty and it's not dangerous to drink. No. No, we just enjoy <laughs> it. You don't stick your fingers in. Okay. This is really cool. I love it. And the great thing about um, this location and all the locations is everything is extra, right? Yeah, so very over the top. I love it. Um, you can't go more over the top than a rainbow colored hamburger bun. Exactly. <laughs> it's super fun. All right, thank you, chef. I'm proud of you for always being over the top. Um, however, pretend it's not bikini season. You know what? Who are we kidding? No, I'm kidding. I don't want to mess that up. Thank you so much. You guys are super Thank fun. You. I'll just go like this. Come to mommy. Come to mommy. Okay, time to pack up those kids and head back to the wild woods. I'm going to show you some amazing places. You might even want to stay. Like I've been telling you guys, there is still plenty of summer left. Hi guys. Hi Jen. Okay, so here's the thing. We're at this place called The Shore House, which I love. I hope that you have been stalking it on Instagram as I have been doing. Um, the cool thing is obviously you can see it's pet friendly. You know what else it's friendly for? A little, you know, taste of summer right there. You can make your TikToks. It's very, very aesthetic here, which is kind of the vibe that you were going through. Yes, going for? A little bit, that's right. We, we've got a great, uh, just a unique aesthetic for the Jersey Shore, and we love having people come out and celebrate with their family, celebrate with their friends, uh, and really just have a unique experience out at the Jersey Shore. And we're just a block off the beach in the boardwalk. Yeah. So we're not trying to be a stuffy five-star hotel. Like, we're very personable. People know us for our service and our staff. So we're here to be uh, a, a friend and an advocate for your stay with us. Let's go for a tour. Okay, and I love that you want to be a friend and an advocate, but at the end of the day, I got to see what these rooms look like. Now, unlike most places, you guys only have a two night minimum, right? That's right, so it's just two nights. So uh, you can come in, you can stay Friday to Sunday, but just about everyone wants to stay longer. <laughs> I know, I would too. And the cool thing is, it's supposed to be like uh, sophisticated and campy all at once, That's yes? right. That's right. It's a uh, it's a it's a kind of beach chic and rep, but we still kept like the retro for Wildwood, right? I love so we're kind of honor the past of the city, but also give you an updated feel uh, to what we have in the city. There is a rumor that I've heard that sometimes on the weekends there's like a DJ here and a bar and a, a cool kind of vibe. Yes. That's right. Yeah. On the weekends we love to have a good time and uh, both on the beach and by our 40 foot pool. It's heated. We put out pool floats. We have a DJ and uh, and we just have a great time up here. We just uh, love to celebrate life and celebrate everyone's special occasions that they're here for staying with us. Here's what I have to say. Uh, I don't have family in the area, so I don't have a grandma's. I love the idea of you guys being available throughout the summer for just a weekend. And that's exactly it. And that's how we started is, is I noticed that need as well when I would come out to the Jersey Shore with my family or with my friends and didn't have a place to stay. I wanted something that would be super easy. So you could literally just pack your suitcase, come down, let yourself into your apartment unit and have everything that you need. So Jen, we literally, not only do we supply the music and the pool, we supply the beach chairs, the towels, the water, whatever you really? need. Really? Yes, just we have it. You grab it. Bikini and my hoodie? That's all you need, and you can come right in and get started. <laughs> I like it. Thank you so much. This is great. And again, summer is just beginning. This is the kind of thing I want. Look at him down there. Are you living your best life? 100%. 100%. That's what we <laughs> love to see at the Shore House, living his best life full side. <laughs> We're going to have so much more when we come back. Thank you so much for joining me on this crazy special. Are you full like I am? Are you tired from the adventures? Uh, no, because you're sitting on your couch. So here's the situation. If you have some ideas for me, I'd love to hear from you. Here are all my social media handles. I've got